Hi, I'm Ifa Orlik, and I'm a native of Croatia and a resident of New Jersey for many, many years. I've been a mental health consumer, for lack of better words. I call it heart, soul, and mind pain person for many years, and in recovery on and off uh, many times, but most recently for about uh, four years, been doing well. Um, through my journey of mental illness, I've suffered tremendously, and I've uh, attempted suicide many times, but I wasn't meant to die. I believe we each have our time and place for everything, and my time and place was not then. Um, I would go to the bottom and uh, overwhelmed by negativity when the chemicals took over. Um, I was over medicated many, many years, I believe, and uh, did not accept my illness. And that was one big problem of mine. First of all, the side effects were horrible, and I would stop when I got better and then wind up in a hospital and in and out of hospitals. But once I got tired of the ring around in and out of hospitals and started saying something is wrong and learning about my diagnosis, learning about my medicines and learning what works best for me and doesn't work best for me, I became more empowered myself and started telling my doctors. Some of them, unfortunately, did not listen to me and said, well, I'm the doctor and you're the patient and I know more than you know. Um, I had many, uh, I realized that medicine was very important when I was in psychosis, but that I also needed a lot more besides medicines, but medicine definitely was important. And doctors at one point for a long time, until I started reading books that they read and talking to them in language that they respected and understood and realized that I knew what I was talking about, listened to me because I said, I know that such and such medicine works for majority or many people, but for me individually, I know it doesn't work. It gives me horrible side effects and I know there's others out there. So once I started taking interest and taking, taking uh, place in my recovery, I became better and better and have been better for a long time. And again, as I said, uh, you do fall down, but every time I fell down, I got up again because I had support, fortunate enough to have support of family and friends and counselors and places like Friendship House in Hackensack, which is a behavioral vocational school, which gives me a place to be myself without stigma. I also was uh, trained by NAMI to speak against stigma. I always was an advocate for the mentally ill, but now have become an official advocate of the mentally ill, Ill through In Our Own Voice program and speaking against stigma, which I gladly do and would will continue to do forever. Um, I am doing well, and there's life after mental illness. And if I, Evka, can talk about mental illness, so can anyone.